our guest, uh, Colleen McRoberts from Bernalillo County. We're just all chums right here at the table. I'm <laughs> <laughs> chummy. Yeah, we're chummy. <laughs> we are. Hey, welcome back to the show. This is Colleen McRoberts with Bernalillo County Open Space. Hi. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Thanks I for have, coming back. Yeah, I have to say I do love starting my day off here at the Morning Brew. So Aww, thanks for thank inviting you. me back. <laughs> you know, we have people that... that don't appear on the show, they just come by to visit. <laughs> <laughs> I might become one of those followers, I have That's to great. say. That's <laughs> great. Coffee's always on here. So. Yeah, exactly. Good. Awesome. Well, what's cooking at Merlino County Open Space these so days? So, we have another fabulous event happening um, this Saturday, and it's going to be on the 16th of November from 4 to 6 p.m. It's called Families Exploring the Wonders of Nature. It's an art show, essentially. What we have done is we have invited families and school children throughout the county to come and exhibit artwork that's um, going to be based off of the four elements of nature so water earth wind or fire and the only stipulation that we gave them is that it has to be made out of natural earth materials so yeah. clay twigs sticks stones um, and so we're just really excited to see the creative things that these folks are going to be bringing and we've had a lot of interest a lot of school children a lot of families are going to be coming out and so um, this particular event is very multifaceted, and so even if people are not going to be exhibiting artwork, it's still mm -hmm. definitely worthwhile to come and, and check it out. So anybody can bring their artwork? Exactly. It's open to it is open really? to the public. We just request that if, if people are going to bring artwork that they come an hour earlier at okay. 3 o'clock. And so we're just really going to go with what they bring. Uh, we know that we have sure. uh, kids bringing uh, 20 pieces of clay from one school, um, some panels of what they actually created at a school, kind oh. of showing off uh, what they've done. So. I, I'm going to be excited just to see along with everybody else what uh, these folks are going to be doing. Um, but this uh, event actually has all these other components to it. So what we're going to do to start off the event at 4 o'clock is we're all going to get together and create an art piece, an installation art piece outside um, mm. where we have designated some space to develop a sensory garden for families. Aww. So um, next year, we're in the middle of designing it now, uh, we will have a place really thinking about the elderly, the people who are you know, working, the moms and dads, the hustle and bustle and need a place mm -hmm. of quietness, yeah. and kids wanting to have wild play and you know, an area where they can taste and touch and smell and heighten their senses. Mm -hmm. um, and so that's what this garden will be dedicated to. And these families will help us kind of sanction that place all together. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. That's Where's really this cool. taking place? It's taking place at Bekeke Open Space, which is going to be on Alameda and Rio Grande, 9521. And if people want more information, they can always look at our website at burnco.gov forward slash open space. Um, and I'll just mention one other thing, which is this event is actually tied to a much larger event that's happening next year. So Albuquerque is one of the hosts for an international exhibit hmm. called families, I'm, I'm sorry, the wonder of learning. So oh. we kind of have a twist on that, the wonders of nature. Yeah. And um, this is coming from Italy. There's three places, I think, um, in the U.S., and we're one of them that hmm. is coming, and it's going to be exhibited over at the um, Hispanic Cultural Center. Okay. And so uh, leading up to that exhibit and throughout the time that it will be here, there's many different people that are doing a variety of stuff. We will continue to ramp up our efforts to do the Families Exploring the Wonders of Nature mm -hmm. programming. Um, and it's, it's really, this exhibit is talking about children and their role within a community. Mm -hmm. The fact that um, this philosophy um, is really all about that they have an active role, that you know, they have just as much to contribute as the adults. Yeah. And so it's, it's going to be exciting, and this event is going to kind of promote all of those things. So. That's nice. Yeah. Now, I'm just curious, uh, Bekeke, is that what it's called? Mm -hmm. Is that also a museum? It's not or a museum. Uh, it's used for uh, schools and people are how is it can the community use it mm -hmm. so it's it's one of our open space properties it's 27 acres and there's a network of trails if people would like to come out to just walk around and enjoy you know a beautiful sunset look mm -hmm. at some of the natural landscapes that we have grasslands and wetlands they can go there uh, we also have an environmental education building that we constructed. Okay, that's what I'm thinking of. Yes, okay. I think so. This has only been open for a couple of years, and so a lot of people don't know about it. Yeah. But it really is just right on the corner of Alameda and Rio Grande. And um, we allow the building mm -hmm. to be used for free by a variety of public groups. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm actually going to a lunch in there today. <laughs> okay. Oh, there you go. You're that's why I was it. like, huh. <laughs> and what is your luncheon about? 
Um, it's a media broadcasters. Okay. Luncheon. Yeah, fantastic. So we have a lot of nonprofits and other public groups that use the space. Mm -hmm. And then we also have this uh, public program that we offer, the Naturalist Series. Okay. And the families exploring the wonders of nature. Very cool. This kind of wraps up your year, doesn't it? It does. It's been Last a very busy very year. Very busy. <laughs> yes, we'll have even more stuff next year, so oh, we're, yeah. we're looking forward to it. Great. Thank okay. you.